Uh, I grew up going to church, um, and then I stopped, I think, uh, near the beginning of uh, secondary school. Um, and I, I kind of, it introduced me to the idea of God, but I'm not sure I got the, the, the full idea, and I'm not sure I fully understood it. So I kind of had a half a belief in God, and not really. Um, so near the beginning of the second year of uni, I started to kind of rethink how I understood the world. Um, and I was thinking that, you know, a world without God in it, uh, I mean, existence is meaningless. Um, and it got to a point where I couldn't kind of half believe and half not believe um, in God. I kind of had to make a decision. Um, and so I started reading different philosophies and looking into different things, um, but none of them could, could provide me with anything uh, satisfying or nothing that felt real. Um, when I'd left primary school, I'd been given a Bible, and in the front of it had a, um, a little reading plan, uh, which I started reading every night. Um, and then I, I woke up one Sunday morning, I thought, okay, I want to go to church again. Um, and I, I'd woken up late, <laughs> and because uh, St. Matt starts at half ten instead of ten, I decided to come here. <laughs> I ran here, <laughs> got here out of breath, um, and then uh, I went on a Life Explored course here, um, went to the student group, I spoke with Hugh a lot, and um, I still really struggled with the, um, it's kind of like, I felt like I'd been split in two halves, um, and it took me a long time to come to a decision, um, but now I can say I do have faith in God, and it really has given me hope, and um, uh, like a meaning for life and a reason. Yeah. Mm -hmm.